Skeletal muscle includes connective tissue wrappings of muscle cells, groups of muscle cells, and the entire muscle. These wrappings help to isolate the electrical events occurring within muscle cells. They support and anchor muscle cells and groups of muscle cells. And then together, they are continuous and form the tendon, which then anchors into the bone so that the forces of contracting muscle cells are transmitted to the collagen fibers of these connective tissue wrappings, which are then transmitted into the bone. Given that as bone grows, it includes the collagen fibers around it through appositional growth, and thus tendons and aponeuroses can transmit their forces to the bones that they attach to. An entire muscle is wrapped in a layer of dense irregular connective tissue known as the epimyceum. Groups of muscle fibers form fascicles, and fascicles are wrapped by dense irregular connective tissue known as the paramyceum. Individual muscle fibers are wrapped in areolar connective tissue known as the endomyceum. This endomyceum helps to separate the electrical events of one cell from its neighbors.